What's going on drone scouts? Well, it finally arrived. My Osmo action cam. So what I want to do is I want to go inside, break it down, put it on the desk, go over all the specs, and then we'll start doing a comparison. I couldn't wait for this to come in. Wait a minute. This is in mind. This is build a drone reviewers. The great day has finally arrived. I got my DJI Osmo action, and I am so excited to do the unboxing of Joe's drone life's DJI Osmo action. Joe must have gotten mine, and I got his. Hey, Joe, let's, let me do this. Let me go ahead and toss this to you, and why don't you toss mine to me? I'm going to count to three. One, two, three. Thanks, Bill. Hey, Joe, what, go ahead and toss it to me. Let me count to three. One, two, three. There we go. Build a drone view. Nice catch. All right, now that I got the right package, let's go inside and start the video. Now that we got it inside, let's unbox it. My unboxing is a little bit different. I won't bore you with all the unwrapping and all that stuff like that. So I already went ahead and did that. You know, but you got USB cable for charging. You got your screw, your mounts, and this is a case for batteries. I'm wondering when you buy the spare batteries if it's going to come in a case or not. And now, the action cam. All right, what I did notice with this so far, uh, I was charging it. It was getting a little hot. So that kind of uh, threw me off a little bit. I also had a problem getting it out of the case. Maybe it's just mine, but I had a hard, hard time getting it out. Okay, now, came out easy. Put it back in. It's like really fighting me, especially on this side. But it's going, I'll have to check that out. But what I want to do is I want to do a close up so you can see everything a lot better. All right, so let's take a closer look at it. Powered on. Nice and quick, right? Come on, focus. All right. So your screen menu. These would be uh, if you want to do custom C1. I think you can add up to two customs. This is your brightness. This is to put a lock on it. Wipe up. Here's your settings. You got your voice control, your snapshot, quick switch, your wireless connection, your wind noise reduction, sounds grid, anti flicker, screen auto sleep, auto power off. I have them both set at five. The LED lights are on. Language is English. My timestamp. Is that is already set at the correct time? I format the SD card, which I did. I have a 64 gigabyte in here and a factory reset, which I don't need to do. All right, down here is for the front screen, either a full screen or a three quarter screen. I got the full screen on. Voice control, I got off. This is your spot metering if you want to lock it. I'll keep it off. Auto rotation, so when I turn it sideways, upside down, it'll always rotate to that there. So now if you swipe over to the right, I'm in auto for pictures, and I can also set it manually, my ISO, my shutter speed, and for my video, the D-warp is on, 
I gotta set it send it D-Light, automatic white balance, and the format, which is the MP4, they do have you do the MOV. Alright, there's nothing here to display. Now when you go up, here's your resolutions. This is the rock steady. When it's highlighted in blue, that means it's on. So I got the rock steady. I do did see when it's in 4K, rock steady is not available with the 4 by 3 aspect ratio. But everywhere else, up to 4K 60 frames a second. Not a problem. I go down to 24. We got the 2K. Rock steady's on with the 4 by 3. Rocksteady's on all the way down. Rocksteady is not available. 7.20p resolution. Let's see. Yep, not available. Did not know that. Alright, so I'll set it back at 4K at 24 frames a second. Okay. So swipe that down. So now, you see the rock steady's on. This is how much time is left on my car. I'm in video, the center. So I'll tell you what, let me put this down and I'll tell you what my final thoughts are for the initial impressions with the unboxings and a couple things I think that DJI can improve with a firmware update and accessory. Okay, so my first impression for this little guy here. I really like it so far. It's nice and heavy. I like the way the menu is nice and easy to navigate through. Uh, I do think they should do at least two firmware updates, which would be the HDR. I see that you can use it for doing pictures and cinema. But the rock steady is not available when it's in HDR. And if that's the case, what's the point in having it? That's my that's my thought. The other thing is I want to see him come out with accessory, a mic adapter for it. Uh, it does have two microphones inputs on it, which is in the top and the side of the microphones, not the inputs, but the microphones. So that ain't bad. Uh, I also want to see them do a firmware update to where you can live stream on YouTube or Facebook. It doesn't have that yet. I think with just those two things, get the HDR fixed to where you can have the Rocksteady on with the HDR when you're filming and live stream to YouTube or Facebook and then come out with a mic adapter. I think this will be GoPro. That's my thoughts. But... I want to take it out. I want to test it. I do some comparisons with the, uh, the Hero 5 that I have. And I'll get my son Sean to help me do that. The other thing that I thought was a little weird. I haven't heard anybody say that when I was charging it. The top here was getting all hot. Alright. And what I did see, which was a good um, bonus. Uh, when I see people doing the videos on it when you want to switch the screen from the back to the front you hold the button on the side and it flips but I found a trick to that is if you use two fingers and tap it twice it automatically goes from the back to the front and then if it's in the front and you tap it again with two fingers not one with two fingers it flips back so that's a nice uh, quick tip that you have for you so I'm going to wrap it up now. I'm going to do some testing with it. I don't want to give you my final thoughts on it. Right now for the price point, it's actually $50 cheaper than the GoPro. That's a, that's a big deal to me. And if the video and everything comes out good or just as good or even better, I think DJI has got a winner. So that'll wrap it up today. So until next time. Peace out, Drum Scouts. Fingers down my side. Girl, you look mighty fine. Oh, won't you rub your fingers down my side? Girl, you look
Matter.